Welcome to the show, You Don't Know Jack. I'm here with my co-star, Jack Tocha. And uh, Jack just wanted me to take the reins this week because um, you only know, felt kind of bad that, um, you know, I didn't get the, the TV personality after TN2. So it was a little bitter after that, but that's not too bad. Oh, TN2, yeah. yeah the Twitter feed. I kind of tanked. Oh, if, uh, you posted a picture of your breakfast, right? Yeah, I think so. Oh, that right. was the extent of my my usage, but it's fun. Well, that waffle made headlines. Yeah, I well, say. I wouldn't be surprised. So, <laughs> Well, we have guest star Joe Tooney, offensive tackle. So, Tooney, uh, tell us a little bit about yourself. Where are you from? I'm from Dayton, Ohio. Um, born and raised. I lived there for the first 18 years of my life. And then um, went to Alter High School. And I came down here for a visit. And I fell in love with the place. And uh, I've been living in Raleigh for the last four years. Yeah, that's interesting, interesting, yeah, really interesting. interesting. Yeah, I have a, I actually got a bigger notebook for you because I had a lot of note. I feel like we had a lot of Oh, yeah, technology. yeah, I know. It's a lot of chemistry between us, uh, I feel yeah, like. Yeah, yeah. Lot of, you know, JT, JT, yeah, yeah definitely. I agree. Uh, why aren't you walking the ponytail today? Um, you know, it's kind of just a daily thing. You know, whatever I'm feeling that day, I kind of let it flow sometimes. It feels good in the breeze. Mm. But then, you know, when it's tight or when it's in a ponytail, I'm usually working out. But right now, I'm just relaxing. So, so it's kind of like a mood ring? I guess you could... I wouldn't go as far as say mood ring, maybe just, you know, what I'm doing at that time, you know, so. So, um, how does it feel to be the first white football player on the show? <sighs> really, it's really, it feels really good. I'm really emotional because of that, and so. Um, it's okay. I, we can take I, a break if you need to. I, I, I was, you know, I'm trying to hold back the tears from that, but it's, um, it feels great. You know, I'm glad you reached out to me, and um, it means a lot being on your show, Jack. It means a lot to have so you here. So thank you so much. Oh, you're so welcome. Thank you're you. So, you're so welcome. Um, so what was like maybe your favorite moment of ever playing? Favorite moment? Well, long time ago, when you were probably in sixth or seventh grade, I was playing here. And um, it was my freshman year. And uh, we were playing four State at home. Mm -hmm. They were ranked third in the nation, I think. And I think I was like 190 pounds playing center. 190? Yeah. And, wow. um, Mike Glennon was the quarterback, and I remember it was fourth down and goal um, over on the far end zone, and we um, called a play, we scored a touchdown, passed to Brian Underwood, and uh, we beat Florida State, upset him at home, a night game, and uh, that was probably my uh, most favorite moment so far. Um, and then second, well, maybe not second, maybe this one competes, but mm -hmm. the game against North Carolina last year was really satisfying, rushing a lot on him, so that was fun. Interesting, interesting. Yeah. Well, I'll have you know, I was at the Florida State game. Oh, were you? And I was a senior in high school. Oh, you were? Oh, yeah, I, I thought was. I thought you were just like a toddler or something. Just because, I don't know, you're a little younger, so I don't know. Okay. It's just... I'm, I'm 19. Oh, oh, you are? Yeah. Okay, congratulations. I consider myself grown. Oh, interesting. Yeah, very wow. interesting. That is. So, you said you were 190 pounds when you played Florida Roughly, State? Roughly, you know, just a guess. How much, how much do you weigh now? Oh, how much do you think I weigh? I think that's a fun question. I would say about 280. So, probably around 290, 295 right now, but... Um, you know, that's a very personal question, So, but um, just because I like you so much, I, I answered for you. Uh, thank you. Yeah. I, well, how many babies did you eat to, you know, <sighs> gain that much weight? Because that's a considerable amount of weight. I know. Um, a lot of protein, a lot of uh, peanut butter and jelly sandwiches late at night, um, a lot of protein shakes to tribute to the uh, strength staff mm -hmm. and the nutritionists who mm -hmm. um, helped me put on some good healthy weight. No, but I asked how many children. I didn't ask, you oh, know, the um, snacks and stuff see, like that. I happened to stop practicing cannibalism in high school. I mean, referring to O lineman, why are your lockers so dirty? I never understood. Why are our lockers so dirty? Because I remember one time we had uh, to clean up the DBs, yeah. and I think I rolled past your locker. It might have been your locker. I'm not locker. sure. Oh, wow. But I'm pretty sure I saw a cro cockroach crawl out of your wow. dirty pile on the bottom of the locker. See, I the thing is, this is a misconception. Mm -hmm. I have pet cockroaches. Oh, pet yeah. cockroaches. So, they're not there because it's dirty. Mm -hmm. They're there because I care for all creatures, you know? Oh. And so I really respect their lives, and I want to give them a healthy environment to live in. Mm -hmm. So I have a nest of cockroaches in my locker. So, you know, I think it's a it's a very nice thing to do for them because not a lot of people, they don't understand cockroaches, people. Mm -hmm. So um, it's good to, you know, help them out. Oh, that's very honorable of you. Thank you so much. I'll pet one next time I see um, one. I don't know if I'd be a big fan of you. Since you started the show, I guess I'll finish the show. That sounds great. That's a great teamwork. I'm Jack Tocho, and this is Gio Tini, and you don't know Jack.